Hello everybody, my name is Cyclone Hunter and welcome to the video. We're going to be watching part 2 of Overwatch Genesis. Now let me explain something, why I didn't do a part 1 off Genesis. Yeah, yeah, I was on the couch, I was already like fucked up, knocked out, my head wasn't there. And then, uh, and then my brother was like, yeah, we'll put it on. And then, uh, I, I didn't watch it, I heard it. And then I watched it after, because he was like, oh, you didn't see it? I will wind it for you. I was like, fuck. But I just didn't, I just said, fuck it, I'm not making a video off this. They released it part two, just now. Uh, 80 minutes ago, they released part two of Genesis. So we're going to check that out. I feel like what they should do now, and I've already said this also in that other video, is that with Overwatch, I feel like we don't need PP no more. Since they're not going to fucking focus on it, what is the point of us waiting for PP? The point of us crying for PP? If literally we're not gonna get PB. Why don't they just take the League of Legends route and just make a show? The reason I say that is because League of Legends literally its popularity fucking skyrocketed after fucking Arcane. And they did a lot more stuff because literally Arcane, holy fuck, they made a lot of money from that shit. Uh, not just them, Netflix as well, and that's why Netflix also blew up. Honestly, I feel like with Overwatch, they could do it. I think they could actually do it. Thing is though, will Blizzard actually take that route? No, because Blizzard is uh, very money hungry. Because you notice they're doing the exact same thing that they are doing with their PvE content. And that's releasing it in little bits. <laughs> I didn't realize that now before I made the video. Okay, all right, this is an hour ago. Okay, I got one other fucking gripe. <laughs> <laughs> Seven seconds in, already a problem. Why? Why do they have uh, pupils? Like, why? Why do they have irises and pupils? That's what I don't understand. Like, maybe. <gasps> oh! 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 Uh, fucking Zenyatta always says the iris. Da -da 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 -da. I just realized the because uh, this is the first. Uh, this is the first Omnic I've seen that has actual eyes, pupils, irises, all that shit. That's where I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> I, I just realized that now. So is this technically the iris? There you go. Theories already. Already building up. Aurora was the first of us to awaken. Aurora? Oh, damn. They would use that name. See, because this, this is the point here that I just said. They don't have pupils they don't have eyes or anything that that's why they i guess call the roar the iris maybe can you imagine how she must have felt i mean she's a robot i don't think they did they actually design her to feel because if so that's uh, that's already where they fucked up born in a laboratory surrounded by your creators and then you learn the truth that there is no other creature like you anywhere that you are truly alone i shouldn't be watching this <laughs> everything that's been going on with me i should not be watching this part two innocence interesting Dr. Liao discovered that Aurora was sentient, that she was alive, thinking, choosing. Uh, it was hard to believe. I didn't want to believe it at first. She passed every single test we could come up with. I mean, didn't your designer to be like incredibly smart isn't that i mean isn't she technically like doing good there i don't know Three, one. and then the entire ah! <laughs> shorty got sued <laughs> we're suing you why i don't know fucking robot i don't know you're different racism <laughs> if if overwatch technically is like the future like the future future of us this is just showing we didn't learn shit because racism <laughs> god damn it. world found out Dr. Liao committed career suicide. Why the so fuck? Why the fuck would y'all bring the robot? <laughs> like, I would say put it under evidence. Don't just have him, like, sitting in the court office. Because <laughs> then in that case, I'd just be like, what the fuck's going on here? 
Aurora know. was alive. I thought it was dumb. But her testimony was very compelling. <laughs> wait, the, what? <laughs> wait, so the robot was a witness? Yes, I witnessed my own my own self being built. I don't know what you want from me. Stin, a stunning ruling. The robot was declared a sentient being. Granted her freedom and released into the world. Isn't there a robot that actually actually had this happen to him, actually? Hold on. There's an actual AI robot. Actually has, like, their own social security, own, like, ID, all that stuff. Sophia, that's her name. Yeah, this is a robot, but she has her own house. She has her own, like, social security. She she has actual shit. That's what I just realized now with the Overwatch thing. Is that what the sword are going based off of with this? I was so relieved. She had a chance to actually live. To so actually live. Free. Sorry, and this she sounds made weird. Most of it. Aurora had been born into a world that she didn't understand. Okay. She and? wanted to see more of it. This is sounding she a lot like that AI just learning, showed. Watching. Seeing how humans treated each other. The good and the bad. But eventually, she had questions about the nature of her own existence. About her soul. And she could only find those answers alone. Hold on, wait a minute. Rewind that? Why'd they give the robot tits? <laughs> <laughs> The fuel pumps, uh huh, sure. That's where the gasoline comes in. She could only find those answers alone. Excuse me, by the way. Okay. No, oh, well, um, while all that was happening. Wait, Aurora was looking for her own shit. How, oh, I guess we're, they're about to explain how Null Sector started. There was a lot more scrutiny into Omnica Corp's operations. It didn't go well for us. Overspending, mismanagement, fraud even. Oh. In a couple of years, Omnico was done. All those automated production lines, completely abandoned and unmonitored for years. By humans, anyway. Breaking news. Excuse me, wait, what? Uh, wanna point this out, wanna point this out. Why didn't y'all fucking destroy the place? This is just showing this fucking future is stupid. <laughs> Like, if y'all know that the, uh, like, if y'all just created a sentient fucking robot that can apparently have its own life and being and all that shit, wouldn't y'all, like, shut the factory down like that? Like, don't get me wrong, that's what happened, but it's more like they went bankrupt. But, y'all didn't destroy the facility? Y'all didn't destroy anything? Y'all didn't claim anything? Y'all just left the fucking building there? Like, um... Oh, God, this is stupid. Gears. By humans, anyway. Breaking news. I don't under, I don't understand. Countless I don't social understand. Media reports of an invasion underway. It remains unclear exactly what's happening in Central Africa, but we do have some footage from the scene. Also getting eyewitness reports of strange robots designed for combat. We were caught by surprise. The world was caught by surprise. So who made them then? Omnics were attacking everywhere. It seemed like every country was hit from every direction, all at once. We didn't know it then, but one of the God programs, originally designed to help humanity, had hijacked Omnica's production lines. <gasps> it's Ram! It's Ramatra! It's Ram! It's a matter. Wait, so an AI that y'all built and didn't delete, y'all just left the facility. <laughs> the US did nothing about, not even just the US, just in general. No government, shape or form, decided to go in there and just, you know, not even delete, but like hijack the shit, you know? Y'all guys just left the factory there. I'm sorry, this is fucking stupid at this point. To build warbots of its own design. I don't understand what you mean. Anubis. Oh. It was built to maintain ecological balance of all things. Okay. For conservation. Its goals could not be achieved without the end of humanity. 
and it used us to carry out its plan. Hey! The dream! It's a monster! Okay. We were running out of hope. But there was a little. There they are. Nine hot! Only a few teams across the world. Reaper to mount soldier defense. Yeah. The of the best Where the join the special strike team called Overwatch. Hey, Anna, hey. Hey, wait a minute, hold up. Wait, 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 wait. That bitch exploded. Hey, hey, hold up. I got this isn't in the game. Look, look at that shit. Explosion. Now she just fires darts. It was a brilliant decision to recruit Dr. Liao. Uh, who knew more about Omnix than she did? Uh, so she is the creator of Echo then. Right? His first victories show the world what Overwatch could do. Soon the cool. strike team Bullshit. was joined by a whole army. Of course, recruits like me were always amazed by what the core team could do. Hey! Overwatch had the impossible objective of winning the war. Reaper! Hey! It seemed we might actually pull it off. Dude, he just hit Death Blossom, that's bad. Ass. didn't sleep, didn't feel fear, and didn't feel despair. But it also couldn't feel hope. Nice. That was what Overwatch gave us. And even then, How come this we 3 DPS? If hope was going to be enough. Okay, I still want to point out, uh, that was stupid. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, the animation was fucking fire. I'll admit that. The animation... I think that's one thing I can always give uh, Overwatch, is that their animation is always going to be like... 10 out of 10, fire. There's a problem, though. The story sounds fucking stupid. <laughs> like, okay, because they, they, they threw in the US government, so the US government's going to be in there. No, don't get me wrong, the US government's a little stupid as it is. Perfect case of point. Shut down TikTok! And no, it's still running to this day. <laughs> but who knows, maybe that, that's that's probably the point they're getting at. Maybe the US is this stupid to where they'll say, huh, oh, you see that factory there that has like an AI that can like, you know, evolve and develop their fucking like skills and everything? Just leave it. Leave it there. Fine. Wouldn't it be common sense for the US government to like, you know, claim that data? Like, claim Anubis, claim all that, and like, you know, either... Not, don't get me wrong, if they did claim it, more likely they would have lost fucking, like, control of it, and then next thing you know, <laughs> there you go. But, even with that said, uh, it's a little, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. It's just... sounds... stupid as fuck. There you go. So far, I'm not excited about joining the world of Overwatch. <laughs> Oh man, dude, I've been waiting for years for this shit, but after finding out like what actually happened with the Omnix, uh, I'm sorry, that's just humanity being fucking stupid as fuck. Our first thoughts <laughs> with building a robot, build an AI that can fucking build the robots, don't claim it once the uh, Omnic core shuts down, nah, nah, what's gonna happen? <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna just leave everything there. <laughs> All the parts, all the metal that they need to make the shit, all there. Evil AI takes over the world. That's the story of Overwatch. <laughs> uh, dude, why? Why? Why can't we do something new? Why? Thank you guys for watching. Uh, like, subscribe, share this video with you guys, friends, you guys enjoyed. And uh, yeah, that was the that was part two of Genesis. Uh, I don't know when three is coming out. I think three is later at the end of this month maybe another thing i want to point out real quick before i do leave is that they said they want to tell engaging stories good stories in general blizzard that's what they said that's what they said with overwatch nothing in this story sounds interesting if anything it sounds stupid as fuck there you go peace out take care have a good day